Once again, I'm Janelle Stelson. And I'm Brian Roach. Today in Harrisburg, a man was set free after two decades in prison. And his case could have major implications for other arson cases around the country. News 8's Barbara Barr explains. 79 year old Hantok Lee was escorted into federal court in Harrisburg. He spent the past two decades in a maximum security prison in Somerset County. His case has been big news back home in Korea. When it happened about 25 years ago, it was really big. Everyone was aware of that, and they, they were not sure which was the truth. Lee was convicted of setting a fire at a Poconos religious camp 25 years ago. The fire killed his mentally ill daughter. What? Fire marshals thought they knew about how to tell the difference between an accidental fire and an intentional fire 25 years ago. Now we know is com almost completely wrong. Earlier this month, a federal judge overturned the conviction, ruling it had been based on faulty science. The belief that an unusually hot fire must have been started by an accelerant. And there will be an avalanche soon of cases where the same junk science was used to convict innocent people of arson. A friend of Lee's thought he was innocent based on cultural rather than scientific beliefs. You know, Korean father never can kill the you know, daughter. In court, a judge released Lee on bail pending a Monroe County prosecutor's decision to appeal. A free man after all these years. Lee read this statement. I don't know how to express my happiness now to finally put this behind me and become a normal U.S. citizen. In Harrisburg, Barb Rivard, News 8. Lee maintained his innocence from the beginning. He will stay in New York under a friend's supervision until prosecutors decide whether to appeal.